Hi, Dave Couch here with Stud Volley Products. Today I'm going to demonstrate shooting aluminum studs with our Stud Pro 2500 Stud Welder. Well, the first thing we want to do is set up my material. Now, I want to make sure the material is clean and that my grounds are on shiny, clean metal. I want to locate my grounds on either side of my weld zone. This is very important. Next thing I want to do is set up my gun. On aluminum, I want to make sure that my spring pressure is high. And on here, I've rotated that dial clockwise to get the spring pressure up to about the 5 level. Next, when I set this for depth, I want to make sure that I've got about 3 16ths to a quarter of an inch of my stud sticking out past the face of this foot piece right here. And to do that, I just loosen these screws and slide this back and forth. As you can see, I've got about 3 16ths of an inch sticking out. Next, I'm going to go ahead and set the voltage on the machine. Turn the machine on. Check your decal here. Now remember, this has nothing to do with the thickness of the material. It has to do with the diameter of your stud. We're shooting a quarter inch flange aluminum stud. Aluminum studs, we want to be at the upper end of the range. It says 130 to 160 volts. Well, I'm going to go a little bit hotter than that. I'm going to go about 170 volts to start. Uh, I've just noticed the experience that aluminum tends to like it a little hotter. Okay, well, that being said, I've got a nice clean here. I used a carb cleaner and a paper towel. I got off all the residue. Now I'm just going to go ahead, shoot a stud. And there we go. And when we shoot our stud, we want to make sure that we've got a fillet that looks very much like this. It goes around the base 360 degrees all the way around. And aluminum, we want it to kind of look a little bit like that. We want to see some of that black all the way around, just like that. Now, to test that stud, I'm going to go ahead and bend it. And if I get everything right, this thing should take a bend. And that's what you should get when everything is right. If your studs are coming off, something's wrong. Check your voltage, check your stick out, check your spring pressure, check your grounds, make sure your material is clean, and that your grounds are grounded to clean, shiny metal. All right, that's a quick tip for aluminum stud welding. Thank you very much.